lot of us are familiar with the idea of donating blood. A lot of us have done that, so maybe more comfortable doing that. But what about the idea of donating plasma? That may be a bit unfamiliar, and with the recent surge of COVID-19 cases, the need for plasma donations is even more critical. Our ABC News contributor, Alicia Quarles, is here now with more on that. Hey there, Alicia. Hey there, TJ. And that's right. Since the beginning of the pandemic, plasma donations have dropped significantly. So our sponsor, Abbott, teamed up with award-winning chef Nate Appleman, who understands the need for these donations firsthand. Take a look. We're at a critical point in plasma donations right now. We're at an all-time low for people donating. This is something that is very special to me because my son, when he was little, he was diagnosed with Kawasaki disease, and it's a very rare disease, but it relies on a plasma-based therapy for treatment. I feel like donating plasma is not talked about often, right? It's not like donating blood, but we talk about it all the time. For those who are unfamiliar, why is it so important? Well, everybody knows about donating blood. Very few people know about donating plasma. And that's why we need to raise the awareness. We need people to want to give plasma just as much as they want to give blood. You know, right now there's 125,000 people in the U.S. living with conditions that rely on plasma-based therapies. And without that, they're not going to be able to get better. I think you're incredible. You're actually putting it into actions, not just words. And you partner with our sponsor, Abbott. Tell us more about this collaboration. Yeah, I, I partner with Abbott because, like I mentioned, my son had a very rare disease. Now, he's 14 years old. He was diagnosed when he was two. And so it's been 12 years. It's allowed us to live an amazing life without the plasma-based therapy. He may not be here today. We want to get the word out there that all the resources can be found at be the one donor dot Abbott. That's be the one donor dot Abbott. There's over 900 sites that you can get out in the United States and donate. So there's really no excuse to not get out there and do it. Oliver, your son's inspiring me. You're inspiring me. But how do we donate? Who's eligible? Just about anybody. So you got to be over 18. You got to weigh at least 110 pounds. You show up, they go over some medical records. It takes about an hour and a half to two hours. Very simple process. Almost anybody can do it. The only thing is it requires time. And I think right now, especially the situation we're living in, in the pandemic, I think each of us have probably two extra hours each day to where we can go and donate plasma. Okay, I'm learning so much, but 2022, new year. I want to know, how's Oliver doing today? Oliver's great. He's 14 years old. It's an amazing time in his life because before he was born, I used to weigh 250 pounds. And I got out there and I started running. I started taking care of myself, which allowed Oliver and I to have a good, healthy lifestyle. Now we even run together a few days a week. We get out before school, like 6 a.m., get out there and go running three or four miles together. It's an amazing bonding experience. Like I said, would not be possible without people out there donating plasma. So get out there and donate some plasma. Make it your 2022 goal. I love that 2022 goal. And thanks again to Nate Appleman and our sponsor Abbott for all the great information. And TJ, I learned so much in this segment. But what's cool is that unlike donating blood, plasma replenishes 28 to 48 hours. So you could do it twice a week. I think we should go. Oh, you know what? You, we should. And you know what? I was asking you questions while the piece was yeah. running because I, we don't hear enough about this. And I didn't know how the process worked and how long it takes. So this is great to, work, to raise awareness for. That's right. We can sit there two hours, get some work done and also raise awareness and give back to everybody. So that's good. Thank you for that. At least the coral. Thank, Thank you, you as always. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.